So learning labs are something that we've tried new this year to um, to get students to come into school a little bit earlier, and they're they're subject focused. Um, classes first first thing in the morning. They're an hour and a half, and they give students, they're asynchronous just like the rest of our classes, and they give students the opportunity to sort of explore in a little bit more depth a specific subject. Um, yes, they have fancy names, like Cash, Gold, and Bread has been developed to sort of um, expose our students to new concepts of economics. So the, the subject matter is similar to other classes you'd have, but we sort of make it fresh and inspiring to inspire students to come and, and engage as well. And the curriculum is a little bit different as well. So we use different projects and different scenarios, specifically in that class, to get students to, um, to understand basic concepts. We want to figure out together, how do you think his reactions in each situation compared? I and mean, how are you processing that as a critical race theory critic? In the institution itself, like in society itself, that they're the bad guys to everybody. Because the way he reacted is making them seem as if it's their fault when it's not. He's just being biased towards specific races. Throughout the day, there's a lot of independent work, uh, much like an office environment in the arena. But in the learning labs, we wanted to make it like activity-based and interacting with, uh, with you know, fellow students. And, and so they're either discussion-based, activity-based, uh, simulation-based. So there's, there's varying forms that it can take, but there's some aspect of individual work with communal work that repeats uh, over and over again. So like in a discussion, you might, you might repeat the skills over and over again, but on different topics. So you would get to sort of move along uh, the competencies that are aligned to discussion or analysis or whatever it is they're discussing. Um, you'd be able to sort of move through the curriculum, but still be asynchronous. So I could finish this class, a new student could come in, or I could be finishing this class while a new student's coming in. We're both doing discussion. We're just in a different place now. So now the student who had been there can continue doing a pattern of discussions and get deeper and deeper into their while the other student exits out and goes to another learning lab.